Happy Wednesday, everyone. I hope you are having a good day so far. And I hope you have a smooth rest of your week. Yay, it's Wednesday. We're halfway through. And yeah, I just hope everything's going good. And everything's good here. Work is going good. And life is going good. And God is good all the time. I really can't complain. I'm grateful for pretty much everything. I, yeah, I can't believe it. Like, I have two cats, which I'm very happy with. And I live with my dad. But I haven't had <laughs> a boyfriend in years, really. My ex and me talked, like, a year ago and for a few months. But he kind of just didn't want me. He straight up rejected my love, so I don't know why I, was, why I was even trying to give it to him. But live and learn. I'm happy being single. It was cool. Once I let go of him, I was able to love myself. And all that love that I was trying to give to someone who didn't want it, which was stupid on my part, um, I took back for myself and I'm so much happier. If you're hung up on someone and someone keeps ignoring your text or putting work first or canceling plans with you, let them go. Cut them off. If they're treating you as an option, they're not worth your time. So take that love and that you were giving them and put it towards yourself. Your importance does not depend on whether whoever you're romantically attracted to respects you or likes you or not. Like, if they don't treat you right, get them out of your life they're not worth the time if they're treating you like you're not worth the time and i don't know i know someone else has to hear that um i had lower self-esteem than i should have for years and it was probably from honestly grieving for so long and trying to justify you know survivor's guilt I lost my mom and my sister to cancer. They were both amazing ladies. And I was wondering, you know, why does God still have me here? And I don't know if you believe in God or not, but either way, you're needed to be here if you're still here. You have time on this earth, you're breathing, you have something to do. Don't waste it on sh giving your love to people who don't reciprocate it properly. Cut them out of your life. If they don't treat you right, or if they just use you, um, take off your rose-colored glasses, which I had to do because I was looking optimistically at the best at everyone, just showing love, assuming everyone does that. But unfortunately in this world, not everyone does show love and lots of people are wearing a fake mask pretending to be nice. So just be careful, guard your heart and whatever energy you've given out to others, pull back for yourself and love yourself. I promise you, you're gonna be happier. And lots of people are scared of independent people who love themselves because they don't understand because they're so codependent on their friends or their relationship or others. But it's okay if you're a loner and you're independent, own it. It's actually a strength. There's way more freedom when just you make your own decisions anyway. There is perks to being single. Of course there's perks to partnership, but there's plenty of perks to freedom and being single. You just have to work hard to make your own money and pay your bills, but pff, that's better than dealing with someone who treats you like crap or ignores you or treats you like an option. Just a thought. Happy Wednesday, everyone. I love you, but God loves you more. Know your worth and don't let them hurt your heart you have control guard your heart don't be jaded don't be cold but don't let anyone mess with you